Hello guys, Ghost Godzilla Thunderbolt here, bringing you guys another review, and today we're going over something a little different today. As you can see right here in front of me, today's review, we are going over the Hot Wheels Super Ultimate Garage Playset from Mattel. Not ultimate, but super ultimate. And this video is for all the Hot Wheels fans out there. As you guys can see, I took out my Hot Wheels collection. And wow, look how many cars is on here. It holds 100, 140 cars. I counted them all. It holds more. I counted them all. I counted them the other day. And I counted up to 165 cars. So, yeah. Before I show you guys the cars. Yeah. Sorry, guys. Before I show you the garage, I'm gonna show you guys the four cars real quick. So these are the four that came that I got with mine. As you can see, we got what? 4-2, Clear Speeder, Symbolic, and Speed Trap. Now, I'm gonna give you guys close-up shots of each car. As you can see, he was what? 4-2. I like how he did him. Got a nice translucent blue. Some yellow in there. As you can see, uh, his, there's his name right here. My thumb is. This is what? 4 2. You can see, I like how he did him. He was clear speeder. Now, I like how he did him. He got purple and. Got, we got orange and purple coloring on him with. with light blue and dark blue dots got a nice translucent pink on the front orange base so as you can see there's his name clear speeder you know, so this car is clear speeder unlike how Mattel did this guy did this car I mean next up we got symbolic I like how there's the glitter and the green paint so you can glitter in the green paint I like how they did the wheels so you can see the name right there, Symbolic. And lastly but not least, we got, oh, sorry, we got Speed Trap in black. Okay, they did them, give them nice black paint. With blue windows. And okay, they did the wheels, got red and blue wheels. And there we go, see, Speed Trap. We got Speed Trap. Okay, so those are the four cars that come with the set. Now it's time to give you guys close-up shots of the garage. So as you can see, it has a ground floor level. Parking level 1. Parking level 2. Parking level 3. Parking level 4, which is your car wash and tune-up shop. And finally... The top level. And yes, the top level the top level is big enough to land its jet plane. Now now so you can see I counted the cars on the top here, so we got nine cars on this side and ten on the other. And I'm gonna give you guys close up shots with the cars here on the top. So as you guys can see that there. We got each we got nine cars on this side. And on the other side, we got ten. And I put my I put my Amazon exclusive Hot Wheels 10 pack on this side here. See so if you have if you have Hot Wheels Amazon exclusive 10 packs. If you have the Super Ultimate Garage, you can put you can put your Amazon exclusive Hot Wheels. On the other side here, you can see we got 10 cars. If you guys recognize these cars, good for you. Okay, so this is what it looks like on the top level here. Now I did count the cars on each of the levels. You can see right here on the ground floor level, we got 15 cars on the ground floor level. 16 cars on parking level 1. On parking level one, you can pause the video right here and count the cars if you like. We got another sixteen. We got another sixteen on on parking level two. 
another 16 on parking level 3. Here we got 26 cars on parking level 4. And on the top we have 19. Now I did preload the, the jet plane here. So you can see that right in there. We got two cars inside the jet plane ready to go. And I'll show you guys the racing action. The two cars you launch out of here and come on the door lane and the door lane spiral racing track. As you can see, they'll race down, they'll race down all the way to the bottom and get right here. And see, whatever car engages, whoever car, car, whoever car crosses this first wins the other car. They get hooked over like that, which you'll see that here in a minute. And I preloaded with 16 cars on the spinner. I did not 16, I put 13 cars in the spinner. Now, now the, when the car is on the elevator, they have to watch out for the big, angry red gorilla. See, he's like the villain of the set. And when he's going up, and you're going up, he'll turn, and he'll swat at the cars as they're going up. Yes, he'll do that. He'll swat at the cars as they're going up. And like how he did it, like how he got the red fur. He's got blue hands, blue ears, and he's got a blue face, a blue chest, and he has blue feet. So like how he did him here. Now, now if you want the car to get off on eat on in the garage, so here's here's the smash button. If the gorilla hits that, if there are two there's all two cars bite the gorilla, so so the gorilla will push the cars out. And we got lockouts on the side here. So you can choose which level you want to be on. I'll show that when the, when the cars get to racing, I'll show that. So we've got lockouts on the side for each of the levels. And it's got extra storage here on the side too. It has, it has this very cool parking tower that holds 14 cars. If you guys see some cars you don't have in your collection, leave a comment down below. And see we got 14 cars on the spinner, I mean on the spinner, in the parking tower. Now this is the battery compartment here. And this, the power of the elevator, the power of the spiral elevator, you're going to need 4D batteries. The power of the spiral elevator. And it's even got more storage in the back of the garage. And the parking tower here on the back. This holds another 14 cars. Giving you giving really exclusive close-up shots of the cars I have parked in the parking towers. And, oh, sorry, gorilla. I was only bumped the gorilla. And we got another. We got another fourteen. In the other tower here, but there are two spaces left open right here. And it has this very cool police station. As you can see, I put speed trap in there. And I put some of my Hot Wheels glow in the dark wheels to help out. And it has this very cool jail. You can see these these three cars right here were causing trouble. Still locked up in prison. You can see those three in jail is Fangster, Ratmobile, and Super Stinger. Yeah, Super Stinger, Ratmobile. And Frank's still in prison because they were causing trouble. Well, they have learned a lesson. And it's got some very cool play areas down here. See, it has a diner. It has a little diner right here. So we don't got overboard right here. He's gonna he's gonna order some food. See, this is overboard. So let me show you guys him. If you can see the name right there, yep. As you can see, that is this is Overboard. He was introduced in 2001. Yeah, and he's gonna plug while I park them. It even has his gas station, so you can drive your car in. You can get fueled up on gas. As you can see that there, ding ding. You can drive around, and there's roadways etched in to the base level here. There's not a portion of the base. So you can drive your car around. You can drive your car around to any of the to any of the spots on the garage. Now it has this very cool hand lift elevator. To take your cars up to any 
of the four levels. But unfortunately, as you guys can see, all the plug-in bays are full. Are full. So that means you have to go back down. Now one thing I do want to point out, some of you may not notice, but there's hidden, not there's hidden parking spaces. As you see, there's three right there, two right there, and there's two right there by the police station. So we're gonna grab our other two police cars that I picked up, and we can park them right there. So you can park cars right there if you want to. You can park two there, and two there. See, so we got three hidden parking spaces here, two there, and two right there by the police station. Now level 4 right here, you got tons of fun on level 4. You can see this is your car wash and tune-up shop, and it's in the turntable here. As you guys can see, it spins, it works on the cars, they go by the brushes. They go by the brushes, and the mechanic arms will work on them. Yeah, so you got lots of fun on level 4 if you want to. And this is why I store my cars that are meant for racing. Yeah, and when they're done, let me fix that, there we go. And when they're done, you can send them out through here. And they'll race down to here. Like, we're gonna go, so here's, here's Quark Rod, he's at the ready. And you can just send them down, like this. You can see who race here. He race right here. See, there was no car beside him, so this one, this one will activate. So I'm gonna go ahead and put Quark Rod in the elevator. Alright, now it's time to show you guys the two cars that I stored in the jet plane. Oh, he got stuck. As you guys can see, if you guys know these two cars, leave a comment down below. And now, I'm gonna let you guys watch him race. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Oh, this car wins. As you see what I mean? This needs to flip up. So every car that races down, you can get through just fine. But for the car that comes in second, that will flip off like that one did. Okay, now for the ultimate challenge. Can the cars avoid getting knocked off by the gorilla? Now, tell me we're going to have continuous racing, so we're going to go ahead and lock this down. And do be mindful when the cars are going up, because some will get stuck in the elevator and get jammed. Does it do turn off if you hear it jamming? Okay. See the switch? Let's turn it on. And see what cars will get up. They'll go to the top and get go fly down. Will the grill get a car? Oh no, there goes another one. There goes a car. There goes another one. These two are going to race. We're going to flip these up. And we're going to give you guys like that. See, I like watching the cars right here. As you guys saw earlier, the gorilla did push two cars out. Oh, my uncle racer got stuck. Get to racing. Somebody up uh, these two up here, see that's what I mean. If they get stuck, wow, that's really stuck. See, that's what I mean right here. These cars will get stuck. Okay, we're good. Now, if you want a car to get off at what level, you can open up the lock out on the side here. As you can see, they'll go out like that. As you saw that there, they'll go out like that, and these two are going to re enter the race. Okay, so these two are we are in another race. And you can see they'll go up and race down from the top. And they'll do that. So this is a very impressive garage here. You can see the gorilla drops down. This is a really good garage. I recommend getting it. If you're a Hot Wheels fan. So here's the instruction manual. I'm gonna fix with this real quick. Crazy how to put the garage together. 
as you can see here, tells you how to put the garage together. Tells you how to play with it and everything. Okay, this car here is causing problems, so Dragon Tail keeps getting stuck, so we're going to take him out. Let the cars continue racing. So, what do you guys think? You're going to enjoy filling this up with your favorite cars? 140 cars up. Oh, this guy got stuck. Oh, wow, he's a little. He jammed up in there. You know what I mean? Some of them will get stuck. Come on. Out you go. This guy is really stuck in there. He moves out. So we're going to take him out. I want these other cars to continue. Oh, this one's going to come out. So we'll let these other cars get the race in. Oh, yeah. So do be mindful when you send cars up. They'll get stuck in the elevator. So that's what I was saying. So what do you guys think? Are you going to enjoy filling this up with your favorite cars? 140 cars. That's a lot. You can rotate cars in and out. And hold on a second. We got two cars that are stuck. Alright, you're going to come out. See what I mean? Some of these cars do get stuck. Get him out. Come on. Come on out. This guy's stuck in here. Okay, so he's coming out, and this one here is coming out. Yes, yeah, so this ghost car kept getting stuck because I had to pull him out. So, what do you guys think? You're going to enjoy filling this up with your favorite cars? 140 cars, that's a lot. And you can rotate cars in and out. Yeah, and this set took me under 20 minutes, took me under 20 minutes to assemble it. I love this garage and it's compatible with other Hot Wheels sets. So you got one down there by the Gorilla, two there, and three in the back so you can connect to other sets if you guys want. But the Gorilla pushed two more cars out. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this review. I try to try to keep it as long as possible for your enjoyment. If you like this video, Give it a thumbs up and subscribe to me if you have the chance. And this video is for all you amazing Hot Wheels fans out there. Hope you guys enjoyed it. This was Ghost Godzilla Thunderbolt signing off. And Hot Wheels fans, keep on racing.